today I'm going to make you the Betsy theory, and the story behind the Betsy theory is the tribute to the origins of the cocktail. And what we found was a very cute story about Betsy Flanagan, who used to run this tavern um, during the British occupation in the 1700s. And what she would do is she would steal roosters from the British commissionary. And although it's unknown the actual ingredients of the concoctions she used to make for the French American soldiers, she would garnish them with rooster feathers, and hence uh, the term uh, the cocktail. One of these earliest cocktails is a julep. So it's craft is a julep and it's a bullet rye bourbon, um, our own sour uh, mint syrup, tobacco and coffee um, liqueur, um, chocolate absinthe, and peach bitters. The first step is we add about 40 mils of uh, our own uh, sour mint syrup, then we put 50 mils of bourbon rye. Um, we add three dashes of peach bitters um, and 30 mils of cacao-infused tobacco liqueur. Um, we stir that, we pour it into a julep glass, and then we garnish it with the rooster feather. The julep always has mint and bourbon and sugar, but we thought, okay, um, from the British Commissionary and the imports and trade, the cow was something very late, or was very rare. Um, tobacco from Virginia, um, and then craft as a julep as one of the first original cocktails. I think it's inspired by our menu too, which is through New Orleans in New York. And digging back into history, we wanted to make a tribute cocktail and make a statement as well. Um, and it kind of inspires the rest of the menu, and it's a cocktail we're immensely proud of.